12 Signs That You May Be Deficient in Zinc Zinc is an essential mineral that is needed by our bodies to perform processes such as growth, healing, producing proteins and boosting immunity. A deficiency of it can lead to problems such as hair loss, depression and low testosterone. Unfortunately, it is estimated that around 2 billion people around the world are deficient in zinc. But luckily there are signs that indicate that you might be deficient in zinc, so today we will discuss these signs and at the end of the video we will also give you ways to replenish your zinc levels. Before moving on, this video is for educational purposes only, and not intended as medical advice, now back to the video. Sign number 1, Thinning of Hairs The first sign you might notice is thinning of your hairs, Though thinning of hairs can occur due to a number of reasons but we can't ignore zinc's vital role in maintaining healthy hair follicles and promoting cell reproduction and tissue growth. Zinc is essential for the proper functioning of enzymes and proteins necessary for hair growth and repair. When zinc levels are low, hair follicles can weaken, leading to hair loss and thinning. Additionally, zinc helps regulate the production of sebum, the natural oil produced by the scalp that keeps hair moisturized. A deficiency can disrupt this balance, resulting in dry, brittle hair that is more prone to breakage. Number 2. White Spots on Nails A deficiency of zinc can often cause white spots on nails, also known as leukonychia, this is due to the fact that zinc is essential for the production of keratin, a protein that makes up the structure of nails. When zinc levels are insufficient, the production and health of keratin are compromised, leading to abnormalities in nail formation. And if the deficiency is severe it can even cause white lines across the nails, so if you notice this sign, it might be a good idea to take some zinc supplements. Number 3. Loss of Appetite Experiencing a loss of appetite might be a sign of zinc deficiency, Due to zinc's vital role in maintaining proper taste and smell function, as well as its influence on various metabolic processes. Zinc is essential for the function of taste buds and olfactory receptors, and a deficiency can diminish these senses, making food less appealing and less enjoyable. Additionally, zinc is involved in the regulation of appetite related hormones such as ghrelin and leptin, so when zinc levels are low, the balance of these hormones can be disrupted, leading to decreased hunger signals. Number 4. Depression The primary reason why zinc deficiency can contribute to depression is due to its crucial role in brain function and neurotransmitter regulation. Zinc is involved in the modulation of the brain's neurotransmitters, such as serotonin and dopamine, which are critical for mood regulation. Low zinc levels can disrupt the balance of these neurotransmitters, leading to symptoms of depression. Furthermore, zinc also supports the production of brain-derived neurotrophic factor, BDNF, a protein essential for neuroplasticity and overall brain health. Reduced BDNF levels, associated with zinc deficiency, can impair cognitive function and contribute to depression. Number 5. Low Testosterone Zinc is a crucial cofactor for several enzymes involved in the synthesis of testosterone in the Leydig cells of the testes. Without adequate zinc, these enzymes cannot function optimally, resulting in reduced testosterone production. Furthermore, zinc has antioxidant properties that protect the testes from oxidative damage, which can impair their ability to produce testosterone. Therefore, Insufficient zinc can directly and indirectly impact testosterone levels, leading to symptoms associated with low testosterone such as decreased muscle mass, fatigue, and reduced libido. Number 6. Frequent Infections If you notice yourself contracting infections like cold or flu quite frequently, it may be due to a zinc deficiency. You see, zinc is essential for the development and function of immune cells, including neutrophils, natural killer cells, and T-lymphocytes. When zinc levels are insufficient, 
the production and activity of these cells are impaired, weakening the body's immune response. Without adequate zinc, the immune system becomes less effective at fighting off pathogens, making the body more susceptible to infections. Therefore, inadequate zinc levels can significantly impair immune function, leading to increased frequency and severity of infections. Number 7. Impaired Memory Zinc plays an important role in brain function and cognitive processes such as neurotransmitter regulation, synaptic plasticity, and neurogenesis, all of which are fundamental for learning and memory. Without sufficient zinc, these neurotransmitter systems can become dysregulated, impairing cognitive functions such as memory. Furthermore, zinc has antioxidant properties that protect brain cells from oxidative stress and inflammation, conditions that can damage neural structures and impair cognitive functions. Therefore, a lack of zinc can lead to compromised brain health, resulting in difficulties with memory and overall cognitive performance. Number 8. Vision Problems A deficiency of zinc can lead to vision issues such as nighttime blindness, as it plays a crucial role in the metabolism of vitamin A, which is needed by the retina to produce a pigment called rhodopsin which is essential for low-light vision. Without adequate zinc, vitamin A cannot be effectively utilized, leading to vision issues such as night blindness. Moreover, zinc's antioxidant properties protect the eyes from oxidative stress and damage, reducing the risk of age-related macular degeneration. Number 9. Stomach and Mouth Ulcers a deficiency in zinc can lead to the development of mouth and stomach ulcers due to its crucial role in immune function and tissue repair. Zinc is essential for a robust immune response, and its deficiency can make the body more susceptible to infections that cause ulcers. Additionally, zinc is vital for protein synthesis and cell division, processes necessary for the regeneration of the mucosal lining in the mouth and stomach. Without sufficient zinc, wound healing is delayed, and the mucosal barrier weakens, making it more prone to ulceration. Zinc also acts as an antioxidant, protecting cells from oxidative stress, and its deficiency can increase cellular damage, further contributing to ulcer formation. Number 10. Diarrhea. Zinc is essential for the proper functioning of the immune system, which helps protect the gut from infections that can cause diarrhea. It also supports the integrity of the intestinal lining by aiding in the repair and regeneration of epithelial cells, and without adequate zinc, this lining can become compromised, leading to digestive disturbances. Furthermore, zinc helps regulate electrolyte balance and fluid management in the intestines, and insufficient levels can lead to fluid loss and diarrhea. Number 11. Low Immune System Zinc helps the body in the production of various immune cells, including neutrophils, macrophages, natural killer cells, and T, and B lymphocytes. A deficiency can hinder the production and maturation of these cells, reducing the body's ability to mount an effective immune response. Additionally, Zinc has antioxidant properties that help protect immune cells from oxidative stress and damage. A deficiency can reduce this protective effect, making immune cells more susceptible to damage and less effective at combating pathogens, thus overall leading to a weakened immune system. Number 12. Slow Healing of Wounds Being zinc deficient can significantly slow down the healing of wounds, because zinc is important for many processes in the body that help repair tissues. Zinc helps with making DNA, dividing cells, and producing proteins, all of which are needed for healing wounds. It also helps make collagen, which gives strength to the skin and tissues, helping wounds close properly. Furthermore, zinc also helps the immune system fight off infections that can make wounds worse. So, not having enough zinc can make healing slower and less effective. Now that we have learned about some signs of zinc deficiency, we will tell you how you can replenish your zinc levels, but before that, 
let's discuss some causes that make you zinc deficient in the first place. 5 Causes of Zinc Deficiency The first cause is eating too many sugary foods. Consuming too much sugar can potentially deplete zinc levels in the body through increased urinary excretion of zinc and by affecting blood sugar regulation. High sugar intake leads to more zinc being lost through urine. Furthermore, zinc is crucial for regulating insulin and blood sugar levels, and excessive sugar consumption can disrupt this balance, increasing the body's demand for zinc and exacerbating any existing deficiencies. Secondly, consuming a diet low in zinc-rich foods, such as meat, dairy products, nuts, seeds, and legumes, can lead to deficiency. Vegetarian and vegan diets in particular, might lack sufficient zinc since plant-based sources are less bioavailable. The third cause might be having a diet with foods high in phytates, such as whole grains, legumes, and some seeds, which can bind to zinc and inhibit its absorption. This is particularly a concern for those relying heavily on plant-based diets without adequate zinc intake. Furthermore, Having gastrointestinal disorder conditions like Crohn's disease, ulcerative colitis, celiac disease, and other gastrointestinal disorders can impair zinc absorption, due to inflammation or damage to the intestinal lining. And finally, excessive alcohol consumption can interfere with zinc absorption, and increase zinc excretion through urine, leading to a deficiency. Now then, let us discuss some ways to replenish your zinc levels. 1. Eat foods that are rich in zinc like red meat, poultry, seafood, dairy products, nuts, seeds like sesame seeds and pumpkin seeds. All of these foods are good options as they have a high bioavailability which makes it easier for the body to absorb their nutrients. 2. Avoid foods high in phytates. Phytates, also known as phytic acid, can negatively impact zinc levels. Foods high in phytates, such as whole grains, legumes, seeds, and nuts, can inhibit zinc absorption. This is particularly problematic in diets that rely heavily on these plant-based foods without including sufficient sources of zinc from animal products, which generally have higher bioavailability. To mitigate the impact of phytates on zinc absorption, you can try soaking them in water before cooking which reduces their phytate levels, and also sprouting them will further break down phytates and increase zinc bioavailability. 3. Enhance Zinc Absorption Zinc is better absorbed when consumed with protein-rich foods. Incorporating protein sources like meat, dairy, or legumes with zinc-rich foods can enhance zinc absorption. But you have to be careful not to overdose on other minerals like calcium and iron which can interfere with zinc absorption. So make sure to consume zinc from the right sources and not to accidentally overdose on other minerals which negatively impact the absorption of zinc. 4. Taking Zinc Supplements the basic daily requirement of zinc for men and women is 11 and 8 mg of zinc per day, though it's possible to meet this requirement from food sources alone, but many people worldwide struggle to do so and become zinc deficient. In which case, over-the-counter zinc supplements can help increase zinc levels. But it's important to take the correct dosage as recommended by a healthcare provider to avoid zinc toxicity. Common forms of zinc supplements include zinc gluconate, zinc sulfate, and zinc acetate. Furthermore, taking a multivitamin that includes zinc can also help, particularly if you have other nutrient deficiencies.